Working on carbon capture and storage projects is extremely fulfilling, uh, not for me personally as a scientist and Geosyntec as a firm, but for the amount of impact that it creates on the communities where these projects are occurring. The economic benefit of these projects is relatively overwhelming. Construction jobs that are temporary that come to these areas to build these types of facilities and the surrounding areas, as well as permanent high paying jobs that keep people employed in a market sector that's projected to increase in the United States as well as globally. In addition to the economic benefits of these projects, there are also some great societal and health benefits as well that come to the environment and the people that live there. These types of projects generally improve air quality by reducing particulate matter and carbon dioxide concentrations and generally improve the quality of life and the health in historically disadvantaged communities. A lot of carbon capture and storage projects are happening in areas that have historically been involved in very heavy oil and gas industry. And one thing that's great about these is we're not trying to replace those types of projects or those employees. Uh, we're simply transitioning them into roles that are better for the environment, better for the economy, and that have long-term economic and societal health benefits that are positive for everyone. The entire process of carbon capture and storage is generally open to the public and to those who live in the areas. It goes through very rigorous environmental permitting processes that have public outreach components. And the idea there is it's meant for the people who live here to have input and to feel some sort of ownership in these types of projects so that they happen in a way that's beneficial for everybody. In regards to carbon capture and storage, uh, our clients like to go with Geosyntec for a variety of reasons. The first of which is that we've been a part of the carbon capture and storage conversation from the very beginning. When CARB initiated the CCS protocol in 2018, we were there listening to what was going on and what's developing. And as EPA class six applications have been uh, developed and submitted to the EPA. Um, we have been helping clients across the country and approximately 15% of all applications submitted in the United States have gone through Geosyntec. 